Mealhouse, we've been kibitzing for the last couple of minutes, me, me and Robin. We've been talking about even, either doing a cooking segment or doing uh, juggling egg segments. What, what, do, we, what do you want to do? You're going to juggle. Yeah? I'm not, I'm not okay. juggling. Robin be Selden. On the floor. <laughs> she, she knows me well. Uh, is with Marsha Selden catering down Yay. in Stanford, uh, part of the uh, Grand Entwined Food Festival, which is going on this weekend, starting tomorrow night. You, you ready for that? I cannot wait. Oh, it's one of the things. Um, it's one of the best seg- One of the best things to do in this state. Put that on your bucket list. Tickets still available. We'll talk, talk about that coming up. Nice to have you up here. Thank though. you for having us. And, and I, I got I to gotta tell you, I'm a little disappointed. Not at you. You seem lovely. <laughs> but I was told we were doing French toast today. I was like, good, I haven't eaten today. And I come up here and I see like tomatoes and eggs. I go, well, what the heck is this? Okay, well, here's the thing. Why would I give you something that you expect? You have to <laughs> twist it and turn is it. That, and that's what's is so that the about. theme behind uh, Marcia Selden Catering? Uh, we do things outside of the box that uh-huh. are a little different and a little unexpected and really delicious. Keep that in mind. Um, All yeah. right, so we're going to do a savory so, French toast. Yeah, we're making a panzanella French toast today. Okay. Um, I was thinking, what was I going to make today? Something that was really in season. Tomatoes are like candy this right now. This is the time, right? I mean, taste this. Sorry, Shelly, you have to taste this. Okay, hold on. I'll yeah. feed it to you. Oh. Um, so we're going to get started. We're going to make oh, our, egg, our egg custard. Why don't you... Okay. Crack four eggs crack in four here. Don't juggle them, just crack them. No, crack them. You're going to whisk that together. All right, I could do that. You're putting me to work here. I am putting so you to work. Well, home. we're a good pair. Oh, hello. Oh, I almost easy did it. Did you see that? Okay. <laughs> and, while <you're> do- <laughs> and while you're doing that, I'm going to make the caprese Killer. topping. You heard that. You got that on tape, right? Did Killer. you get that? Go ahead. So he's got his four eggs. You're going to then add some dry mustard, pour that whole oh, thing in. the whole in. thing going in? Yeah, I'm going to let little, you do this all by mustard. yourself. Okay. Just I know what sure. I'm doing. Why should you work? You're going to do a little spoon of that. That is crushed garlic. Okay. All of this basil pesto. So this is where the twist comes in. Okay. What do you got pour here? Pour that well, in. No, no, you a just, homemade basil pesto. Just look at this. Okay. Toasted and, pine nuts. Oh, so delicious. Do you know what the secret I do at home? I, I tell it all the time. I make pesto sauce without putting the oil in. I freeze it. And when I want, I defrost it and I put the oil in. You're very fancy. Thank you very I much. Know. Fancy pants over fancy here. Fancy killer. I know. <laughs> That's going in. Okay. Go ahead. So we have, um, I'm going to be making the tomato. Can I start tomato. whisking this? You can start whisking this, and then you're going to add half a cup of heavy cream, half a cup of milk, and then your Parmesan. So you're going to break okay. those eggs up and get it into a nice custard consistency. And meanwhile, okay. while he's busy, I'm going to add my tomatoes because I want to make the caprese topping. Okay. A little bit of mozzarella. I mean... Who doesn't love some cheese? I love mozzarella. I Absolutely. Know me too. And put it's put all the, the all the way. cheeses going. Yes, please. Okay. We want like cheesy deliciousness. You with got this. it. I know. You got it. That's, okay. that, by the way, that's another nickname for me. Cheesy never. deliciousness. <laughs> Robin's never met me. She's never coming back. That's what uh, we're. <laughs> I'm coming back next week. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm adding a little salt here. All right, we're down to one minute, so let's go. One minute. Okay. Um, I'm gonna chop up some parsley. There, there's your there's your egg cus- custard mix. Okay, you're gonna. We're gonna. We only have a minute. Yeah. We, we, Why are you cutting me out like that? Much, I need like five around. minutes. Uh huh. All right. So again, good day old bread always this helps, but a panzanella is nice. That is good looking. You're gonna toast this Look here. At this. Soak this up. We're going into a frying pan here. Check us out. While you're doing that, I'm gonna mention you're gonna be one of the featured chefs over at the Greenwich Wine and Food Festival. You're doing all the interviews in the lounge where you talk to all the big hot shot celebrity chefs and whatnot, right? I am. Well, Friday night, I'm cooking at the Big Easy um, Amazing Dinner, the VIP that. dinner that they're Honor- oh, they're actually Honoring uh, Martha Stewart. Exactly. Yeah. Um, we're going to cook our thing here, Okay. our French toast. And in the meantime, I'm going to finish the topping okay. while that's cooking. Get tw- you got 20 seconds to do this. All right. We're going to give a little squeeze of lemon juice. Uh-huh. And that just goes on top. You're going to saute that for how long? I'm not sautéing this. This is all fresh and delicious. Okay. Just so really going really on top like of the, egg, the, the uh, tomatoes are already done. So there's the finished product right here. Tim, get a shot of that. And really, I, I got to tell you, everything you just did, all kidding aside, was not hard. Very easy to do. I mean, anybody do. can make this at home for themselves. So the, you know, we've got to wait for the um, the French toast to cook. But ultimately, it's going to get this nice golden brown crust on it. So it's very moist and delicious because you've let it marinate in your egg custard. And then you top it with this. The entire recipe is going to be on our website. All the Look. ingredients to our right. Uh, Robin Selden, thank you for coming in. I'm going to take, I want a bite of this, and we don't have time. I'm going to eat it while we send it down to Erica in Studio 61. I'll save some for you, Erica. Yeah.